Hey everybody, it's Kelly and I'm here today to sh reveal the Cheeky Studio September kit. So I am part of their design team in case you did not know that and my kit came in the mail today so I thought, and I have a layout to do so for the month, so I thought that I would just get right to it and take a look at what was in the kit. So it came um, wrapped in this yellow tissue paper. So I love how that themes with what I've seen some previews. So I kind of know what's here. And the first thing that's here is sketches. So last month, um, Tuesday began including these and this is the wildflowers kit. So she's starting including sketches in with the um, kits. So that'll be fun to use. And I did use mine um, last month. So let me take the other piece. Then I'm going to go to the paper first. So, well actually let me do this. This is the collection that this is based off of. This is the Wildflowers set five. So let me take this out. These die cut packs are loaded. Now I do have, I just got, um, just ordered personally some of the other Wildflowers collections because I kept hearing so many good things about them and I didn't have them. So I'm excited to play with this new one. So let me just go through and I will kind of lay out what's here. Look at how cute these packs like I said are always just loaded and they're single flowers and um, multiple flowers large flowers small flowers these are just gorgeous some reds here some blues and purples and pinks here's one that says happy uh, one that says awesome, which is one of my favorite words. This one says great, or create, sorry. Oh, so these will be fun. I'd forgotten about those. Um, this one says hey. More branches. This one says sassy. That works on many levels for me. So look at, uh, oh my gosh, how gorgeous and how much stuff is in here. This one says love. This one says hi. And there, some of these are repeats. But that's okay because I like having like multiples. So I guess if I can spot those quickly, I'll just pop them on top of each other. Like this one, there's three of them I just noticed. Oh, this one's a little bit bigger version of that. This word says joy. Here's another multi-photo. This one says thank you, so that would be nice on a card too. Oh my gosh, these are so cool and so loaded. This one says smile. This is another, what's well, a version of that. Let's see, this one says hello. Oh, and then there's a couple of these flower rings. I love that when these get included. I like to use those for journaling spots. So there's two sizes of those. I always want to count these for you guys, but then it it would take forever because there's so much in here. So, and then some of these leaf sprays. So this is what's included just in the ephemera pack that goes with this. And I love the... The bright um, purple and yellow and orange and red and blue. So kind of some cool different colors here. So I'm going to just scoop this all up. <laughs> That's easier said than done, right? Because there's so much in this pack. All right. Then now that you've seen that, and I'll kind of leave these on the side so you Kind of have a like a color like inspiration or not inspiration but match here so you can kind of see okay so that's the pack of the ephemera then tuesday has now created 
Oh, and look, guys, I missed like five or six pieces here when I opened this up. My goodness, huge, huge, huge pack. So Tuesday has created her own papers now. This is the first time we're seeing this, if I remember correctly. And they match this set. So this is the first paper. This is um, the Wildflowers number five paper, and they are not named, so I just wanted to make sure. So this is the gorgeous floral wreath paper. Look how beautiful that is. Hmm beautiful and then there's this really beautiful red and pink paper as well then there's this corally kind of floral with black centers and then this cute pinky corally color paper love this then there's this aqua paper with one of the sprays. And this is neat. I didn't even realize this. I, I've seen a preview of these papers, but there's like journaling lines here. So that's cool. And then this nice kind of leaf spray in the purple. Then there's, this is a cool paper, just something different, kind of like a painterly swatch and then the flowers at the end and they kind of make a really cool sort of um, uh, dye mill across the page so you could you know use like you know do something like this well really kind of like this I guess or you know mount your picture here or mount your picture there this is cool and then on the back of this is a yellow with some sprinkles. Couldn't think of what I wanted to call that. So that's a cool paper. Then there's this really pretty mint with some little black dots on it. I love that. And then this brown with um, leaves on it. Then this next paper is a frame paper. Mm, love that with the purple. Ooh, and look at that. So sometimes people find these really intimidating, um, but I like to use these. And sometimes I use them as a full background. Sometimes I use it where I put, use them more kind of as a frame, more like kind of, that's hard to see. <laughs> this is not cooperating, but you know, more like a frame. This is not a great example that I would do that with, but that one's a cool paper too. And then also in here, we have cardstock. So, ooh, this is beautiful cardstock. So there's three pieces of this kind of pinky red, and then this really pretty pink that's almost a coral color as well. So that's really beautiful. So I'm going to spread these out for you a little bit so you can see them and I think I'm going to turn them back around here Ugh. I have to see if I can find a photo of my granddaughter that this will work really well with because I I'm in love with that okay so let me see if I can do this without creating a disaster yeah I did pretty well there okay so that's that then Tuesday's included a really cool sequin mix here. So there's um, like a purpley color and a copper color and an iridescent. So that'll be cool to use. She's also included some of her bows, which I so appreciate because I have a granddaughter to scrapbook those with, but I would scrapbook them anyway. Then these are the cut apart pieces that go with the wildflowers. So this is the cut apart labels. And you can see they have things like smile and hooray and surprise and they go really beautifully with those colors. And then these are the cut apart circles as well. And I think if I remember, you can use a one inch circle punch on these. I do like these, I like adding, I like that she offers these cause then you can get a little bit of roundness into your kind of square layouts. So I'll add those in here. And then this is a set here from Close to My Heart 
and it's called compliments so that comes in a little baggy and you know what I think I'm gonna pull this out this way so that you can see what it is without me having to pull out like all the little die cut pieces so there's um, navy I'll show you the colors here there's navy and aqua and kind of a peachy orange color here and what that set is oh this is very cool oh and there's more in here so these are the die cuts here they say things like enjoy today and then there's flowers some florals the good times here's where the navy starting to come in a couple little cacti and then on the back there's these little cacti again and a couple of other little border things the happy day words this one says let's celebrate with some green and yellow so there's a lot of different colors in here which is really cool and it says shown in suggested groupings here so you can pull these pieces out and just make your layout with that so that's kind of a cool thing and then ah I see okay so some of these are um, what this is is these are the pieces and then there's also more pieces here too so these are stickers that's what it is okay so some of these are stickers on these things and some of them are die cuts which are included here so I've never had close to my heart um, product before other than the things that I've gotten in a couple of kits so those are really cool as well too so that guys is the wildflowers oh there is a number I just realized these papers all have numbers on them so I'll go back through that really quick so that you know what they are so sorry about that but anyway um, this is what's all included in the kit and it coordinates beautifully let me go back through these I didn't realize because the first paper I had I think said five or something I missed yes it does so this says wildflowers and it's paper number five that's the um, wreath botanical and then this is number six this one is number seven the sprinkle paper is number eight this little mint dot here is number ten this brown leaf is number nine this cute little pink flower is number three and then this corner flower design here is number four and then this one is number one this little scattered leaf here is number two then the frame paper is number 11 and then this one is number 12 so guys this is everything that's included in the kit you can go to um, the cheeky studio website which I will uh, include in the description for this video and get your kit um, your kit subscription ordered you also if you order anything else not the kits this doesn't apply to the kit but I will leave a code it's Kelly 10 at the end of the video and you can get 10% off on anything else you order not the kit but on anything else so I am going to go grab a photo of my granddaughter and start scrapbooking with this so hope you guys are all well and I'll be back with another with, I'll be back with the layout soon